Hey guys, welcome back. I'm so glad you're here. Welcome to the Focus Series. <laughs> and today what we're going to do is a 15 minute biceps and triceps. So we're gonna burn those muscles out. And because of that, I am gonna make sure I use a little bit lighter weight because I know it's gonna fatigue doing several exercises back to back to back. So I kind of have my light to medium dumbbells with my 10 pound dumbbells. I'm just gonna use the same one all the way through. So kind of grab that. And remember in this focus series, we have no warm up or cool down. This is like an accessory or you just need a quick workout. But so make sure your body is nicely warmed up and make sure you grab a sweat towel drink. And of course your great attitude. Let's get this thing rocking. Okay. So hopefully you have a chance to grab your dumbbells. We are going to start with five exercises of working on those biceps. We're going to burn those babies out. We're going to start with a hammer curl. So I want you to roll your shoulders back. Your palms are going to face each other. We're going to come up and then control that baby down. You ready to rock this with me? Here we go. In three, two, one. We're coming up and then we're controlling it down. We're going to do two rounds of this. Okay. And we're just going to pause in between. Not a real long time. Coming up and back down. Nice and controlled. Both directions. Now I got a lighter weight, so it's gonna feel a little bit easier right now. Don't worry, we're gonna burn that out. <laughs> Coming up and back down. You got 15 more seconds. Like I said, we're just gonna pause and do it again. Keep that head above those shoulders. Here we go. Three, two, one. Pause, roll those shoulders back. Here we go, three, two, one. It's just enough time to kind of reset yourself situated and back in the game. Nice and controlled, up and back down. Nice work. Stay strong and steady. Okay, work at not getting that head jetting out there. 15 more seconds. Nice and controlled, we got five, four, three, two, one, and a rest. Okay, so we're going to do pronated next. So our palms are going to face down. We're going to come up and lift, okay? If you need to slow it down, you can alternate sides. You ready to do this? Here we go in three, two, one. So we're pronated. That means our palms are facing down. When our palms are facing up, it's supinated. Again, I know you know, always want those anatomy lessons. <laughs> Okay, it just, it really works your gripping muscles too, okay? Those forearm muscles are part of your grip. Okay, it really pulls that out and then just works those biceps just a little bit differently. <sighs> nice and controlled. 10 more seconds, then we'll pause and do it again. <laughs> you got this, come on. Up and back down. Four, three, two, one, and pause one more time. Roll those shoulders back in. Three, two, one, up and back down, nice and controlled. Oh yeah. Like I said, doing all the five exercises on this, burns that baby out, works out. That's why I picked the lighter dumbbells today. <laughs> 15 more seconds. Nice and controlled. Oh yeah. We've got five. Four, three, two, one, and rest. I need to shake my arms out. Okay, we're gonna keep our arms right here. I'm gonna go in and out. Okay, so like finding that 45, in and out, keeping our palms up in that position, elbows tight to that chest. Roll those toes back in three, two, one. Right here, in and out. Okay, nice and controlled, holding that position. Woo, oh yeah. Nice work. Stay steady. Nice and controlled. 15 more seconds. Pause to shake those arms out and back at it. <laughs> Here we go. We've got five, four, three, two, one. Pause, shake them out. Roll those shoulders back one more time in three, two, one. In and out right there. Oh, yeah. I don't know about you, but my biceps are starting to feel on fire. Need to shake it out. Come right back in. Dig those elbows. 
Okay, it's a nice good hold right there. 15 more seconds. Here we go. We've got five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Okay, shake those out. We are just gonna do a nice good isometric hold. That means we're just gonna hold that baby there. That's all we're doing. But burn. It's gonna burn. Okay, let's roll those shoulders back. <laughs> Here we go in three, two, one. We're holding it right there, baby. Oh man, yeah. Hold that baby, nice and tight. Palm facing up, head stain. If you need to, you shake it out. You bring it right back in. 15 more seconds. Nice and controlled. Oh yeah, you should be feeling those things on fire. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Pause, here we go, one more time in three, two, one, right back up there. Here's the good news, after this, we only have one more activity on the biceps, okay? So we're just gonna do a regular curl, okay? To get that lactic acid out of there that's building up right now from these isometric holds. Oh my, whew, come on, stay steady. I'm talking to myself. <laughs> 15 more seconds, you got this. Come on, push through that burn. You're doing great. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Shake that out. Okay, last bicep curl, okay? We're gonna go from here and we're gonna rotate it up and then we're gonna rotate it back down. So our palm faces us to facing up and then back down. All we've got left, okay? Here we go. Roll those shoulders back in three, two, one, up and back down. Then we're gonna go to the other side. We're gonna go to the triceps, okay? The antagonist to the biceps. One bends that elbow up, one extends that elbow, one bend, flexes the shoulder, one extends the shoulder. Oh yeah. Finish strong, 15 more seconds. Here we go. We've got five, four, three, two, one, and rest. One more time, roll those shoulders back in. Three, two, one, curl that baby up. Pushing that lactic acid, man, we built that up with those nice good holds. Ooh. Oh yeah. Keep that head above the shoulders. Nice and controlled, come on. Stay steady, halfway there. We're gonna do an overhead extension next. So you can do one dumbbell or you can do two. Okay, I have a little lighter weight, so I'm gonna use both of them for that. Here we go. We've got five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Okay, I'm gonna go down. I'm gonna do a tall kneel. You can do this standing. I'm gonna take that dumbbell and I'm gonna come down behind my head and I'm gonna go right over. So you can do one, but if it's too light, you can add two. You ready to try this? Here we go in three, two, one, we're coming down behind the head, and then we're extending up and over. Nice and controlled, down and up. Nice work, come on, stay steady. Ten more seconds. Four, three, two, one, and pause one more time. Are you ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. Down behind the head, up and over. Start burning that backside of those arms. Oh yeah. And One and rest. Oh, shake those out. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do um, uh, kickbacks. So we're gonna squeeze those shoulder blades and we're gonna kick that extension and back down, okay? 
Squeeze those shoulder blades when you do it, and you're gonna pause at the top and back down. No swinging. Here we go. Three, two, one, out. And back. If you need to, you slow it down. Alternating sides. Okay, get that butt back there. So you have a nice neutral spine. And that butt, that glute is activated. Takes that pressure off that back. Boom. Okay, I'm not swinging. Pausing at the top. Coming back down. Come on, 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and pause one more time. Here we go in three, two, one. Extend and back. Nice and controlled. Nice work. Come on. Stay focused. 15 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Okay. Woo! And this time we're gonna do shoulder extensions. So we're gonna keep those elbows straight. We're gonna squeeze behind us and we're gonna kind of take that pinky and go a little bit behind. So back and behind. Here we go. Three, two, one, back. Squeeze and come down. Notice I'm not using momentum. I'm just lifting back, squeezing. Elbows straight, taking those pinkies, pulling them behind, and then a little in, and back. Nice work, come on. Boom, and back. Nice and controlled. 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and pause one more time. Woo, baby, here we go in three, two, one, lift and pause, back. Okay, we're gonna go down the ground after this. We're gonna do a skull crusher. Don't worry, we're not gonna really crush our skull, but that's kind of how it feels when we're moving it. <laughs> You can do it with one dumbbell or two. Come on, hang in there. 20 more seconds. Nice and controlled. Don't let that swing. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Okay, down on the ground. Here we go. We're going to do this right up overhead. Let's see if I can see this. Okay, so we're gonna come right down and up overhead, bend those elbows straight back behind you and lift and extend. Here we go in three, two, one. We're gonna touch down and come back up. Okay, going right up over your forehead and extending back up. Nice and controlled, both directions. You got this, come on. 15 more seconds. Oh yeah, four, three, two, one, and rest one more time. Are you ready? Here we go, three, two, one. We're coming down and up. Okay, exhale as you press that up, okay? You're bending those elbows down. You're extending those elbows up. We're gonna stay in this position for the next exercise. And guess what? It's the last one. Oh yeah. Woo, 10 more seconds of this. Five, four, three, two, one, and a rest. Okay, so you're gonna press this down tricep press and back up. So you're coming straight down, elbows next to the body. Okay, kind of mid chest and then pressing up and back down. Here we go in three, two, one. Pressing up and back down, so tricep press. Okay, think about kind of like when we do dips. Okay, we're using that to press that up. Tap that top dumbbell right to the shoulder. 
and then extend and press that back up. Woo, yeah. Come on, 10 more seconds. Three, two, one. Pause. One more time. Let's finish strong in three, two, one. Press that up and back down. Come back down. Tap it. Press that up. Woo, baby. Yeah. Come on. Press that down. Press that up. We are almost done. 15 more seconds. Okay. You got this. Your arms are going to look amazing after this. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. And rest. Nice job. Way to go. Make sure you're stretching out those arms. Make sure you're grabbing some water, some high quality protein. And every day. Hey guys, did you like that video? Make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss the next workout that's gonna drop. Also, let's become friends. Join me on Facebook and Instagram to know exactly what's coming up next and to hear great tips and tools to help you be fit, healthy, and feeling amazing. So again, don't forget to hit the notification bell and subscribe so you can always stay in touch and have a great day.